Hi, uh, that was me playing La Marianne and it's probably I think three years since I did a blog um, and again a very truthful blog because obviously I wasn't playing it that brilliantly um, but make no excuses I'm starting again from scratch again isn't it ridiculous um, because I just haven't played very much and, and I'm having to start just refreshing my memory on all of the pieces that I used to play um, and the reason being because this is going to date this video is that we're in lockdown this is April 2020 and we've got the coronavirus that's hitting the world um, terrible times I mean really really terrible times um, for me I've had to uh, change my whole work pattern I, um, I have quite a busy job but I'm able to remote in and work from home so for me it's not been too terrible um, in terms of keeping a job. Um, I know so many people actually can't. Um, we'll, we'll talk a little bit about that. Um, but yes, yeah, so I've been able to work from home and it's given me a little bit of extra time. I don't have the travel time. Um, and because the, the place where I work, um, I think it's all right to say it's a school, the school itself is actually closed. There are only children of key workers going in. Now that's just made things quieter altogether. So hence a little bit of extra time for me and unexpected and I've made the most of it. I just thought, right, well, let, let's get back. Let's get back to my music, which is the thing I have really, really missed all this time. So um, hence refreshing and going back to scratch, learning some pieces that I used to like and just getting the hang of it all again, getting back into the flow of it. Um, as you know, it's a tricky old instrument if you put it down for a while. And, and I've just loved it. And I'm, I'm going to learn some new pieces as well. Um, if you've subscribed to my channel, you'll see that I've done a couple of stop motion films. And uh, that, that made me think, well, I've, I've got to learn some more pieces to go with them because it's quite good fun. Um, so the last one I did was um, it, they're, they're, they're my grandson's toys. Um, I, I only need to explain, I obviously can't see him. I'm one of the vulnerable people. I can't go out at all. Um, I, I'm, down, I'm locked down for about three months. And um, I've missed him terribly, so I just thought, well, what I'll do is I'll make some little videos for him. And I FaceTime him, obviously, and he's really enjoying them. He's, only, he's just over two years old, and, and he's really enjoyed seeing this and seeing his toys and seeing you know, my house and, and me on FaceTime. So that's been good fun. And, uh, yeah, so the, in, in the last one I did, there was two tunes that I thought, right, I'm going to learn those. One of them is English Country Garden, and the other one is more Pathrant. Um, no, that's <laughs> that's quite a hard one to play that second one um i'm getting all my pushes and pulls completely mixed up the the language uh, i don't do it on camera but the language has been interesting <laughs> while i'm pushing in the wrong place when i should be pulling but there you go that's the melodium for you and anybody who's taken up this instrument will know um so yeah so in lockdown um there, there's advantages and there's disadvantages um it's strange not seeing people. It's strange not going out at all. I can't even go out for a walk. <clears throat> um, and I've missed my work colleagues, of course. But then I count my blessings all the time. And that's why I say count your blessings because at least I do have a house. I don't have a tiny flat. I can go out, I have got a garden. It's small, but I've got a garden. I can go outside. And there's so many people at this point who must be going, oh, I don't know, despairing. Um, heaven knows what your circumstances are if you're watching this and, I, and my heart goes out to everybody those of you who are worried about jobs those of you who are missing loved ones or, or need help those of you who have struggled to get food and, and the essentials um, and then of course we all know we, we've all heard those messages our NHS staff, our carers all those people who are literally fighting this terrible thing day in day out um, yeah what can we say um, hopefully we're all doing as we're told, we're all staying at home and we're all taking the pressure off the NHS so they can deal with this crisis properly and deal with a number of people coming in. Anyway, this is a Melodium blog, so I will stick to the Melodium, so just forgive me if I just had to say something about it, but it, it's kind of relevant. And the relevance is picking up my music again, and I think a lot of people, if they are at home, are now thinking about their interests and what they used to do and their hobbies. and. And, and hopefully are going to use their time creatively. Now, if, if you're one for social media, you've probably seen tons of people out there singing from their homes. I'm not talking about celebrities. <laughs> Don't get me started on celebrities. But people are 
pick up their instruments, playing their music, singing their songs, joining in with their family via Zoom and FaceTime and all those lovely little things that we have. And, and we've found a new way of living. We found a new way of communicating and we found a new way of working. And it's going to be interesting. I, I wonder what it will be like when we come out of this. So here's my little Melodian blog. Um, I'm going to really work hard, I promise, and I'll try and do another one soon. So thank you to my subscribers. Um, <laughs> Thank you so much for your lovely comments and, and for subscribing to my channel. Um, and I promise I will do something. So I'll probably do English Country Garden first because it's slightly easier. And then I will do more Pithrant and, and I will come back and I will do another blog in a, maybe just a few days, maybe. It depends how long it takes me to get back up to scratch. As you know, I play it as it is. Um, I don't edit it, you know, a tiny bit here and there. I try and play it as it is. So you might hear a mistake. You might hear that it's not wonderfully played. I'm not a professional. I haven't been playing for years. I've been playing for a few years. And and I think that's that's why I call it a truthful blog vlog. Um, and I, th I think hopefully it will encourage you. Pick up your instruments, whatever it might be. It might not be melodian. It might be something else. It might be an old guitar, a ukulele, a drum kit that's sitting in the garage, a keyboard that's getting sort of dusty. Pick it up, have another go. Go back to the, go back to the beginning. Go back to the easy pieces that you used to be able to play. Don't set yourself an impossible task. You have to encourage yourself. So pick up something easy, something that you can get back up to scratch quickly and go for it. Just enjoy this time and make the most of it whilst you have a little bit of extra time in your hands. And hopefully it will encourage you. Keep your spirits up. That's the important thing, isn't it? Um, and I wish you all very well. I hope you're all doing okay in all of this. And um, let me know how you're getting on. Cheers. Bye. Bye.